This is a city. Some call it Denton, Texas. We call it Reaper Land. Hey, my name is John. I'm a giver. You're the giver. Merry Christmas. <laughs> yeah. You want you want John to have, be your secret Santa. <laughs> <laughs> You're not wrong. I I did have a limit for my secret Santa this year of two hundred dollars, and I went over that by like seventy bucks. So secret Santa, the yeah. stocking? I thought it was twenty. No, 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 for my own secret Santa. Like oh, my friends miss. Okay, not this one. I've been t I've been told. Hi, Reaper Land. <laughs> hey, I've been everyone. told that we're doing a stocking this year. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Ed's taking care of that. I, I have no idea. Uh, so. I'll, I'll talk about it. Oh, okay. <laughs> Only uh, over by 70. Oh, yeah. I'm talking about my secret Santa. <laughs> yeah. I like intros like that where we're just kind of talking and you just start the show. That's fun. <laughs> yeah. Hey, everybody. How's the sound? The sound sounds a lot better to me, so hopefully yeah. it sounds better to you guys. Welcome. What day is it, John? It is Friday the 11th, which is Feel Good Friday. Feel Good Friday. Here at Reaper Land. Uh, welcome. I see a lot of people in chat that are normally here. Uh, I want every single one of you to go put on your social media that we're live. So spread the word out there. No. Get some more people in here. Am I road dog? I think we started one minute late. But yeah. John and I are the professionals of the, yeah. of the five. Mm -hmm. John, Sadie, and I were the professionals. Yeah. And Anne had an emergency this morning, but she was only like five minutes late, 10 minutes late, something like that. But we tried to be on time. Yeah. Unlike some people like <coughs> Ron. <laughs> <laughs> I bet you in 45 minutes, Ron will come in here and start getting ready for Bones mm -hmm. 5 Live. Yeah, with one minute left to go. Mm -hmm. And then it's like, okay, get this over here. Okay, put this, plug this. <laughs> this isn't working. <laughs> um, but while we wait for people to, to get notifications and emails and stuff to come in, uh, you were talking about the stocking thing. Yeah. Uh, so in the recent years, we've been doing a lot of holiday stuff. It's like we've been doing more of it, like more holiday events, like pumpkin carving yeah. and uh, food exchanges. Well, it was a shit year, so let's try <laughs> and make the best of it, right? <laughs> yeah. And this year we're doing a stocking exchange, and it's the first time we're doing it. Normally we do like a party, like we go bowling or something like that. But this year we don't really want to do anything no, like that. <laughs> no, no. Yeah. So. That's a... So uh, Reaper Land, just to let you know, Ron would go out, Ron and Adrian would organize this bowling, and they would divide up into two or three teams, and the winning team g would get a bowling pin as a trophy, and then all the winners would sign it. And every year, I always give Ron a hard time, like, what do you walk around to? The other employees going, loser! <laughs> <laughs> it's, we put them in the uh, gallery. Yeah. So all the bowling pins are in the gallery. <laughs> Oh, there you go. That's the idea. Start the beer advent calendar. Now, there, there you go. go. <laughs> yeah. By the way, advent calendar, if my fiance is watching, is what I was trying to remember last night. I made a joke that all of my post-surgery uh, meds felt like a, uh, like, a, like a narcotic advent calendar because <laughs> yeah. that's what they look like. It's X per day. What, and they what do I get when. next? Oh, Vicodin. Yeah. <laughs> <It's>, it's, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> My grandma used to have this, or my grandpa and grandpa. It's yeah. like a long thing. It's like yeah. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Yeah. 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 Get used to it. It's coming. It's coming. <laughs> uh, Justin's feeling a lot better. Today's for those his first who, day back. Yeah. For those who don't know, Justin went to the dentist on Tuesday, and uh, he's been popping pills ever since. He's our local drug lord now. Mm -hmm. Oh, speaking of drugs, uh, my girlfriend got a new um, insulin. Mm -hmm. thing for her uh, diabetes or, mm -hmm. you know, whatever. But it's this new thing where it's an inhaler. Yeah. And you inhale it and it's insulin. Oh. Uh, so it goes into your lungs and it absorbs into your bloodstream oh. and all that stuff. Lung so you don't fast. have to inject yeah. insulin and all that oh, stuff. Oh, cool. And you're supposed to take it right before you eat. And it's just very interesting. And I was like, I didn't even think about doing insulin that way. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but apparently it's pretty new. It goes, it, yeah, so. it goes, and the lungs would make it go, well, I don't know if you're injecting, that would be pretty bad, so. Yeah. I guess, but yeah, get tired of being a pin cushion. Yeah. <laughs> and she, she just started it, so um, we're going to see how it goes. Yeah. So I'm, I'm kind of curious. Yeah, well, let us know. Mm -hmm. uh, colorblind painter. Did Justin have COVID? No. No. He had his wisdom teeth taken out, and he's now just totally stupid. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I got to get my wisdom teeth out soon, too. 
those should be happening in the next month or so. Yeah. So I like how you checked your watch. Yeah. <laughs> I have all the months written right here. Right there. <laughs> so it's going to be fun. Uh, hopefully. 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 Are they are they deeply embedded? The two bottom ones are out. Oh, okay. The two top ones are impacted on my uh, hmm. phone, I guess you could say. They yeah. grew in diagonally. Yeah. But they're not in pain or anything. Oh. But I just need to get them out. Yeah. I, uh, I never had any wisdom teeth, so apparently I'm not wise. They didn't come in? Mm -mm. You just didn't have them, period. I don't think I had them. Wow. Hmm. Somebody else was saying that. I think it was Adrian. Yeah. Adrian said that one of her kids just don't have them. Doesn't have them. Yeah. Just they're, or they're so small that they're that they're not yeah a problem. Hey rings, I haven't seen you post in a while. Hope yeah. you're doing okay. I'm sure work is probably really busy. That's probably why you've you've been disappeared. Justin, so. you you need to say something. Coffee nerdy beer said you sounded awful yesterday. Oh, I and I feel much better today. Like genuinely, yesterday to today feels the the best. Thank you, Coffee, for noticing. I appreciate that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, we do need the Justin ornament somewhere. Oh, a little Justin picture? Yeah. Um, yeah, Switch somebody was in, talking like, about Right that. in here or something, right here on the table. Uh, somebody was talking about my ornaments last night. Yeah, I like doing things like that. Maybe I'll try to go back and find all my intros that I've done Yeah. and see if I can kind of smash them together. Hanging all that stuff off your beard? Yeah, ornaments. Yeah, but yeah. was it painful? No. Oh. I could I could barely tell that they're there. <laughs> <laughs> oh. The studio's haunted. The mic is moving. <laughs> <laughs> no, it... Uh, uh, yeah, you, you don't even feel that they're there. No. Oh. You just put the You're little just, metal hook... Just a the... walking Christmas tree. Yeah. Well, uh, two years ago, three years ago, I did a cr glitter beard. So I might do that again this year. Mm-hmm. I, I've been debating on going to the barber, but I'm kind of scared uh -oh. to go to a barber. Well, ask Chet. Should he go to the barber? <laughs> well, it's more for <laughs> COVID stuff. I haven't left the apartment to go do anything, really. Uh, we get our groceries delivered. Yeah. I just go from work to home, work to home. Yeah. Yeah, that's pretty much what we do. Yeah, Occasionally, no though, we do, we do have to get out to the grocery store because... Dad would need something that mm -hmm. we didn't order, so we put on our mask. We have our hand sanitizers and mm -hmm. do that. Um, Jed One Taz says that he's starting his Bobby Yaga's hut this weekend. I hope it goes well. Oh yeah, let me know how the feet go. You I'm not saying cut the beard, just uh, trim it. You know, yeah, it's getting a little crazy. I haven't uh, cut it since this whole thing started. Uh, cranky dog. Why are you guys wearing ID tags? Oh. Well, I don't know who this guy is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah. Um, you want to talk is, about this? Yeah. This is, last, uh, this is the last virtual ReaperCon. I just kept it on the, the chain. I let, put it on there because we were doing live broadcast. And then this is my time card where mm -hmm. we did a high profile of, of tape and put your <laughs> picture on there and, and taped over it. So mm -hmm. this is for time cards. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks for okay. the gift sub, Dirt Diver. Or not for the gift, but there thanks for the gift. All right. Um, yeah, this is what we use to get into the building and scan our time and all that stuff on our time clock. And Nomaz wants to know, are you going to, uh, you need to braid your beard? Have you ever braided your beard? Oh, yeah. Um, during Reaper Con Online, yeah. uh, Sarah braided my beard for the game, for the D&D game. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, that's right. Um, can you get one to watch QVC before the Bones update? So he's prepped to sell us the hell of the pirate ship. <laughs> um, yeah. Uh, I know you're, you're going to be able to see the new production yeah, pirate ship. It's right over there on the table. I can see it from here. Oh, no, that's the print. Oh, is that the? No. He's going to bring over the new one. Oh, that's right. That is the, the production print. piece. Yeah. Um, and you're, you're going to see a lot more stuff today, too. Today, mm -hmm. that's at 4.30 p.m. Central-ish. Um, I think he called it the Bones update, B O N, bonus. The bonus, oh, bonus update. B O N E U S. Bones, -S. bones update. Yeah. yeah. Bonus. You know Ron. He yeah. loves puns. Yeah. Reaper Standard Time. Yeah. You're going to see Eric Hoth the Ancient, uh, Kalanzar, a couple of the dragons, you know, Pirate Chip. It's at 4 30. And then later on tonight uh, at 6, Justin? 
Uh, correct. 6 p.m. Central, you'll be able to watch Reaper Errant tonight. Today is a really busy day for Reaper. Yeah. you got four shows. Yeah. you got Anne this morning, us right now, Bones 5 Live Update, and then Reaper Errant. Th Fridays are packed. What was, the, uh, what was the last situation, Justin? Do you remember on Reaper Errant? Uh, they just hit level five. I know that. Mm. Oh, um, okay. Specifically, I don't remember where they camped. I think they were in the middle of... It was before they advanced. They, they were in the town, let me think. Oh, those are always good. They are. They <laughs> yeah. are. I, I know they hit level five, and I'm trying to remember exactly where they left off. Because um, it was two, two weeks ago? Two weeks yeah. ago? Yeah. yeah. And this is, by the way, this is important because I believe this episode is will be the last episode before the new year i, I believe mm -hmm. because the next uh friday they would play is christmas and i don't think they're playing on christmas no yeah the next day would be the 25th yeah, yeah. so i would make sure to catch tonight's episode yeah. it's going to be important and then uh we'll see you guys for reaper in 2021 see if proctor kills somebody uh, on <laughs> the last episode oh that's what it was they we spent a lot of time talking uh, a lot of time yes. talking i forgot about that and enough that Proctor basically fell asleep. Uh, yeah, I remember he said. <laughs> he said, if you go back and watch the VOD, just skip the first half. That's what he said. <laughs> so I remember him saying that now. Um, last night in chat, you know how we, we were talking about the Reaper Keeper? Yeah. And the whole ship debacle thing that's going on. Um, but there was, a, there was me. There's and, a ship debacle? Yeah. Remember? The, sh the ship that... Uh, it didn't capsize. Yeah. What happened? The shipping boat that tipped. Oh, oh, oh. I thought you were talking about the pirate ship. Yeah. No, no, okay. no, 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 no. Yeah, yeah. The actual transport ship yes. off Hawaii. Yes. There you go. Um, and we were talking about the Reaper Keepers. But me and a couple of people in chat were making jokes about the Reaper Keeper. Mm -hmm. And I said, yeah, check out the new Reaper Peepers. It's our new sunglasses. <laughs> uh, and then we just kept going with it. There was the Reaper... Reaper leapers, yeah, like our new boots or trampoline. <laughs> uh, Reaper, and then we were trying to come up with all kinds of things that were like that. The Reaper like, creepers, yeah, Reaper creepers, <laughs> yeah. Those are, my, those are binoculars, yeah. Um, and then, so I just thought about making fake commercials, yeah, with uh, maybe some April Fool's Day. Stuff. There you go. There's enough time to plan it. Yeah, sure. the Reaper steepers. Um, <laughs> they're like inclines. Um. I Trampoline. thought that was so funny. We were having a blast in chat last night, making jokes like that. Uh, let's see. Yeah, the ship happened to the ship. Yeah. Uh, we still haven't been notified if that was part of our uh, of our stuff. We just oh. know that it's been like 18 containers. 1,800 containers, containers were lost. Yeah. I don't know about containers that were damaged. Right. I think they're still assessing that. Um, <laughs> Reaper Steeper's tea. <laughs> Love it. If you guys have any fun Reaper Keeper puns. Keep them coming, because I think they're hilarious. Um, yeah, the way that Ed was describing it to me is that there's a lot of insurance companies that are involved, and oh yeah, you know, it's just going to oh, take yeah. a long time to yeah. assess certain containers and move them around and things like that. Reaper sleepers, their pajamas. There you go. Yeah. Gosh, this is so fun. So funny. <laughs> Get your Reaper sleepers for your, for your baby, the little onesies. <laughs> Reaper beeper. Yeah, voice recorders. The Reaper Beeper lets you know when a new product goes live, oh. like when there's new release. Mm -hmm. Your Reaper Beeper goes off. Yeah, so, yeah. <laughs> Tom Hanks is sitting on an island, going, "Great, what a what the <laughs> hell!" <laughs> <laughs> he starts painting miniatures. Yeah, well, I got nothing else better to do. <laughs> I would buy so many of those. Yeah, <laughs> that's so funny. Maybe I'll make a list. I'll go down a list of all the Reaper jokes. Yeah. That we can make. Reaper Deeper. They're shovels. <laughs> there you go. Like I it. love it. <laughs> That's my favorite. All right. Um, so we were talking about earlier, there was a couple of days ago, where we, or weeks ago, where we were talking about a calendar. Mm -hmm. And I was thinking a little bit more about that along that, those lines. I was thinking about writing up something for the other departments and kind of what they want their picture to be. So like okay. if we did it by department, mm -hmm. so like January could be casting or February might be the shipping department <laughs> or something like that. Paint department, you know, and just asking them what their picture would be. And then we can have uh, photo about, shoots. What about, and I'm just going to spitball here in front of everybody. Uh, 
what about having a contest and that, that those pictures get put in in you know like for January February or something so like you're on your mm. discord yeah. if you get people to vote and they go oh I like this one and so we can put that in in like a picture of it in January or two of them or four of them in well a they month. can be collaged yeah yeah hmm that is a good idea I think people would rather much see the miniatures than just Dave sitting there going yeah, yeah. <laughs> we could make it a smattering. How about that? There you go. Start jamming stuff together. Because, of course, you know, the accounting office would have to be the biggest, most grandiose. Oh, uh, yes. It gets its whole page. Yeah. yeah, yeah, exactly. In when is Texas? Uh, February through May. All right, we'll give you February. There you go. <laughs> Actually, February. Oh, there's the ghost January, again. January, February, March, April. We'll, get, we'll give you May. It's at the very end. Yeah. The very end of it. So... The, and then, uh, what are you looking at, Justin? I don't know. <laughs> but I was also thinking about putting, I don't know if we've ever done anything like this for the history of Reaper. Yeah. Uh, I kind of want to do a timeline. You know when you see those timelines? Yeah. And it's like, up. it's like, uh, founded 1992. And right. then go down the timeline, and then the next big thing. Yeah. You know, like, purchased our first building or some whatever. I kind of want to do that. At this that. date, Ed said, oh, shit. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh-oh. Yeah. <laughs> We're going to need a bigger factory. <laughs> you know, like moving to Mill Street. Yeah. Uh, just big milestones I think would be cool. I kind of want to do that. Maybe we yeah. can. Yeah, and, and Ed's son went out and took pictures. We could go back and take pictures of the old the old places to mm -hmm. go, okay, well, here's what it looked like, you know. Yeah. Yeah. I, I, that would be really fun. So I'm going to put that on my list. of. Things put that too. on your list. Add it. Yeah, I'm all about content chat. <laughs> <laughs> um, what is this tax you speak of? Oh. I haven't gotten a return in a few years. Oh. Yeah, I'm right there with you, Miller. I messed up on my taxes a few years ago. But and now I'm all caught up. Because he came to me. Yes, Dave. <laughs> it's all Dave. <laughs> He says, my just wife, let me do it. My wife always complains, you know, before we got married, I always got a tax refund. Now I haven't <laughs> seen one since we've been married. Uh-oh. <laughs> First million figure sold? Oh, I see. Uh, mm, I don't know that, if we've sold a million of one figure. Oh, uh, one figure? No. no. No, definitely. I don't know if we've tracked no. what the millionth one. But over overall, uh, I would have to say the very first Kickstarter... Mm -hmm. I think if I did that, the calculations correctly, it was over six million figures in that first one. In the first one? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. That's kind of cool to know. Is Ed's son or your nephew? Let's see. Uh, Gint, <laughs> Ed's son, Jeremy, is my nephew. Yeah. Oh, that's the tall one that comes by. Yeah. Okay. He works for UPS. And at one time, as a, as a present, he went by all the old Reaper places, took a picture, and then made a collage and gave it to Ed. And oh, it's sitting in, in his office. office. Yeah. Oh, that's my favorite yeah. picture. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe uh, I'll post that on social media. That's a good Instagram picture. Yeah. Redcon, the vampire pledge had like 250. Yeah. We were just mm -hmm. talking about that. The uh the vampire boxes from Kickstarter One were just white. And I think they said vampire or maybe nothing at all. It just, said vampire box on it. Yeah. On the top part. Yeah. <laughs> and now you get four color arts and yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's what Ron's been doing. Uh, and he, you know, he, in our company meetings every week, he's like, you know, just working on boxes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um, he does a lot of the art graphic and, and corralling the artists. So that's, mm -hmm. he's our art director. Yeah. So. And he's been banging them out. Uh, I know he still has quite a few left to do. The lime green dark heaven. No, mm. sorry. Sorry, bug lips. <laughs> I have some pictures of those on my computer. Speaking of which, John, uh, uh, our, our Discord feed is looking like hammered potatoes again. That's fine. Uh, we don't have to show anything. Um, let's see. Uh, Valandar, that's a good question. Or, yeah. Yes, you, you are correct. Um, Garrick the Bold, Sir Force Scale, mm -hmm. is getting a metal miniature in January. Oh, um, yeah. the, the miniature has always existed. It's mm -hmm. been in an army pack um, as a set, but now he's being taken out of the set and being made on his own individually. Oh, really? So oh. you could always buy him as a Bones model. 77008 hmm. is the model. But now he's getting his own Warlord number, of uh, the metal figure. Yeah, he got promoted. Yeah. <laughs> he's not Sir Forscale anymore. He's, oh. what's after Sir? Lord? 
Yeah. Lord, well, sir, sir is a knight, mm -hmm. so you were always a lord if you're royalty. Um, mm -hmm. But yeah, you would. What is it? A count, and then mm -hmm. I don't uh, know. The chat. highest is a duke before you become a prince. So duke. Something. See. Duke yeah. For duke for sale. Yeah. Lord for scale. <laughs> or right. Lord for sale. <laughs> oh, Justin, real quick. Um, I sent you an email last night with a GIF. Um, I don't know if you're able to put that on screen or... I am. Let me see. How... Baron. While, while you're looking yes, at that. Yes, Baron was in there. So I guess you yeah, had to be a knight and then a Baron. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm, I'm not up on my royal titles. <laughs> um, speaking of that, um, Lur Sir Forscale... Um, I actually, somebody found a long time ago, Brian Stilts, Stilts? Uh, okay. did a thing on the forums where everybody painted their own Sir Force scale and mailed them in. Um, and we actually found a bunch of those yeah. and I have them all and I'm going to be taking a picture of them, like a group shot of all of them and yeah. I'm going to put them in the gallery. Yeah. Um, oh yeah. Look. What? <laughs> uh, that's Sir Forscale. In a, there you go. He's like an animated GIF. Uh, this was for the Discord. Um, so one of the community members named Hasio mm -hmm. uh, in the Discord has been making a bunch of, um, what's this, pixel, animated pixel art for us. We have a uh, Sophie. Yeah. Oh. She's doing this with her fingers. She's like beckoning oh. to come here. Yeah. Uh, we have Grim from Reaper Virtual. And we have Sir Forscale mm -hmm. right here. So we've been doing a bunch of these, and they work great as gifts. There you go. <laughs> Bonking Dave on the head. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Oh, wrong way. <laughs> that way. <laughs> yeah, this is an uh, animated pixel gif. And so, yeah, you can use it as reactions uh, in the Discord if you have Discord Nitro. But we also have a static version where he's just holding his sword up, just like normal Surf or Scale. Shuggy Mom asked a question a while back. Um, Wanted to know how we started Reaper. Uh, the mm -hmm. we originally started what we we were both accountants working with our dad at the accounting office, and at night we played in a uh, a house band. Ed played drums, I played bass, and literally, yeah, literally, uh, someone had seen some of Ed's painted stuff and says, "You know, you could sell those airplanes at a gun and knife show," and so well, okay, I'll help him, and we painted them up. And we took it to the gun and knife show and sold like a thousand dollars of it. And we go like, well, hell, he wasn't lying. <laughs> so we took that and invested it in a uh, vulcanizer and a spin caster and started uh, doing just airplanes. And mm -hmm. we called it uh, Distinguished Flying Collectibles. And uh, that's how that's how it all started. And eventually, it morphed. We don't do the airplanes anymore. And we got into the fantasy figures and renamed the company Reaper and all sorts of fun things. It's because of Heritage, right? Heritage Heritage uh, was a premier company in Dallas that they went bankrupt in the early '80s, and Ralph Partha became the premier. Mm -hmm. And then uh, one of the uh, employees from Heritage. Uh, out of, bought some of the figures out of bankruptcy. And so when we were doing the planes, he, he needed a job, wanted to become a partner. So he became a partner and part of his equity stake with these old heritage figures. Mm -hmm. And so we started, we started producing those. Hmm. Yeah, I so didn't know the full story. I knew, yeah. I knew the general story of it. Yeah. So that's kind of, we always have our, our heritage back to, to heritage miniatures. And yeah. during ReaperCon, usually they, uh, they, they have their reunion. big reunion. Some of the old employees show up here at Reaper, and, and they have their little reunion, and mm -hmm. the tours come by, and they can talk to them and yeah. that sort mm -hmm. of stuff. Yeah, They're normally up on the mezzanine. I remember they're, they're always up there playing games and eating pizza. Mm -hmm. So, And they're here like late at night, too. So. Uh, F. Francis, how did you decide to switch entirely away from airplanes to fantasy? Fantasy sold a lot more. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that, was a, that was a pure accountant move yes. right there. <laughs> uh, bug lips, then in 96, Dark Heaven. Literally what happened is we'd accumulated some money, and then Ed and I uh, had a discussion. And it was, well, do we, we, we need to get more sculpts. We need to get more fantasy sculpts. But do we put them in this uh, line or do we create a whole new line? The old heritage line, you've now like mixed it. So the reputation of that old line would not 
go away just because you're adding new figures. So we decided to come up with Dark Heaven as the new line, new name. So uh, that's where Dark Heaven came from. Yeah. Dark Heaven. Shout out. And then what came after that? You know, Warlord, Chronoscope, Pathfinder. Yeah. Yeah. We throw out, uh, yeah, but, and you should be around sometime for all the times that we're trying to come up with names. Well, what do we call this? <laughs> yeah. Now we just leave it all up to Ron. Yeah. Yeah. In fact, uh, I have a meme that we're probably going to show at the next Reaper Live concerning something like that. Uh, 2659. Are you looking that one up? I have to look that one up. 2659? Yeah. the uh, Their very first figure. Um, yeah, you need to document this history. Yeah, Shugimon, that's kind of why we started talking about it. I was doing a timeline. Yeah. Uh, and I think it'd be cool to put it somewhere, like on the wall, like on a wall somewhere. Yeah. Like a big... I, I like putting things on walls. I don't know if you've noticed. <laughs> um, but can like, you know, right out here in this hallway? Yeah. Leading up to this? Mm -hmm. uh, imagine just a big... Timeline wall. I think, yeah, we're also, uh, the eventual plan is, is mm -hmm. that we sponsor a bunch of uh, painters on Twitch. And what I wanted to do is like the next time we actually have an in-person convention, mm -hmm. which hopefully is this year, is we get some of them and get Justin's photography ability together <laughs> to actually get a picture of them. And then we can put their picture up in the hallway as mm -hmm. our Twitch family. Yeah. Uh, especially during ReaperCon. So when people come and visit, we, we want to be able to take pictures and things like that, you know? Yeah. Of, of all the people, all the artists, teachers, just fun things that are happening and just put up pictures all over this wall um, on the, in this hallway here. And when, and when you guys start taking tours, when everything opens back up, this will be a part of the tour. Oh. So. And 2659 is Pitor Iron Gale? Yep. It's the rogue with the chain. Yeah. Something by Bobby Jackson. Good choice. Twenty six fifty nine. <laughs> Painted by Raquel. Um, Raquel Bothrick. Bothrick. At least on the website. That's the first yeah. name I've. That's the first yeah. time I've seen that. Real painters or us? <laughs> um, <laughs> we don't know. It's all an idea right now. It's yeah, but I mean yeah, just get some of the pictures. The uh, the Twitch family. Mm -hmm. uh, you know the artists. Yeah. If you're, the, are you going to be at ReaperCon? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> everyone. I don't. I don't know if the studio is that big, Caporia. Everyone. It'll yeah. be really small. Um, <laughs> yeah. What are those Get a, here's your magnifying glass. Go <laughs> yeah. look at the wall. <laughs> it's like, uh, what's it called? All you art people in chat will know. It's where it's a big picture made up of smaller pictures. Yeah. Okay. Collage. There's a name for it. Yeah. Is it a collage? Mm, yeah. Oh, really? Litter? A mosaic. There you go. Collage. Something like that. <laughs> I just didn't know the exact name. I didn't want to be wrong. Or a mosaic. Yeah, collage mosaic. See, things are a lot easier when you pretend to be dumb. Yeah. So that way you just get... And then I just we just ask chat that. and yeah. they tell us, you know. <laughs> so this way, if I say something wrong, I'm just like... Yeah, okay. I mean... <laughs> Don't you know that chat is, uh, is a brain surgeon? Chat is a... <laughs> yeah. Chat yeah. is everything that you need. Chat's a I would believe it. It's great. Yeah, it's a hive hey, mind of all the knowledge. Chat, I got greats on my math homework in college so what did you get greats greats so yeah thumbs up yeah, he, check oh. marks he's not kidding we we've been uh giving him <laughs> yeah. crap for this Justin for literally <laughs> over a decade it's been over a decade yeah yeah my Some college those, algebra classes i got yeah, great he, he didn't get a number it literally just said great, great circled with like oh. i think there was a sticker even nice. so i rely on chat a lot mm. it's a lot easier that way there's a lot more smarter people. I surround myself with smart people. So. <laughs> like, if I don't know something, I, like, ask the mods on, on Discord and stuff. I'll be like, hey, what do you guys think about this? <laughs> yeah. Like, that's that's like, what you got to do. I need feedback. Smiley face stickers? Mm -hmm. Did you get those? Uh, are you talking about this? No, I guess. I, oh, were on my paper. About, on, on your my paper. paper, yeah. No, I didn't get any gold stars in college. Mm -hmm. If you're the smartest person in the room, you're in the wrong room. <laughs> uh, Francis, that will be on the calendar, hopefully, when that eventually happens. What, smiley faces? Uh, no, people in the, like, people around the factories and stuff. Oh, And the yeah. people that want to be, obviously. Not everybody wants to be on camera and in videos and things like that. I don't know. I'd be interested to see what chat would say. Would you rather see really good painted Reaper figures, or would you rather see um, the Reaper employees or a combo? So that's a good question. You should ask that in Discord. Wait, do what is it? Sorry? I missed the ending of that. Me? Yeah, what were you saying? 
You I was don't listen chat. to me? You don't hang on every I was word. reading chat. <laughs> uh, Both. Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, would they rather see a calendar of just oh, highly detailed painted I stuff see. or just the employees or a combination? Both, I think, would be fine. Yeah. I, I'm thinking various empty chairs around the factory, and then we <laughs> call them pictures of me. Oh, yeah. Because <laughs> yeah. he's never here, Chad. He's that's, the ghost. That's what it is. He's the spirit. Like, my mic, as it's moving, that's usually Justin messing with him. So. Yeah. It's a... It's a thing here. Now, where do you put the coupons in the calendar? Because if you if you clip it, now you've destroyed one of the photos. Yeah. Mm. We talked about this. We'll talk about it more off camera. Oh, okay. <laughs> there's some logistics. It's a little stuff. touchy there. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, there's no gallery this week. Uh, we're just chit chatting this week. Yeah. Catching up on stuff. Um, oh, actually, if you guys type in exclamation point RCL. In chat, I can do it for you. Exclamation point RCL. There you go. It should pop up a link there. There's the link. Only one person has to type it. You can see it in chat. Yeah, it's like a, I think the default is like a 20 or 15 second cooldown or something. Yeah, I think it's oh. 15 seconds. The idea being not to spam it. No, no, guys, it's not a command yep. nope. to like Stop. get into something, it's just information. Um, yeah. So the Reaper Challenge League, I've been talking about it. I finally put everything up. Everything is there. If you click on that link in chat, it sh it'll take you to the post detailing all the information. Um, if you guys have any suggestions, I know that people were poking holes in my rules and we were fixing and enjoying everything. enjoying it. Here we go. Yeah, destroying <laughs> it. Um, you can see here on the screen, it might be a little bit blurry. Is that blurry, Justin? Uh, it's not the best. Okay. Let me, let me see if I can full screen it here for a second. Let me, let me try to pull this in just a hair. But when you guys look at that, you'll see all the information there. And basically the thing is, is a lot of people are poking holes in it because they like competition and they like to earn as many points right. as possible. Um, but this is designed to challenge yourself yeah. and to be fun. This is not a contest. <laughs> a lot of people are trying to, you know, how do I game the system? But <laughs> you're, you're cheating yourself if you do that. So I'm going to shame you. If you do that, uh, <laughs> this is meant to be fun and just have a lot of challenges. Uh, and if you have any ideas for challenges, there's going to be special events that pop up throughout the year. So maybe in Valentine's Day, we might do something, you know, month by month, uh, just little pop up challenges here and there to add to it. There's still there's quite a lot already on there. You can see like down here. Here's the first quarter. Mm -hmm. So the first theme for January is ice and fire. So you choose something, ice or fire, and you paint something in that theme. So you can get a werewolf and paint his fur like fire. Yeah. Or get a get one of our toads and make it an ice toad. You know, your your imagination's there. Um, yeah, I called this one the freebie slash shelf of shame. Uh, so this is to help you get through your backlog. So all your shelf of unpainted stuff. Yeah. You know, each month you choose one, you get points for it if you paint it. Oh, um, so it doesn't have to be themed. It doesn't have to be themed. No, just the themed. So the themed ones are worth three points. Yeah. Um, there's a limited palette each month. Uh, and let me clarify, because uh, if you look at the rules on the page for a limited palette, you see right here in January, it says blue, green, pink. You can choose any shade of blue, any shade of green. But those, that's the only shade you can use. So I made it very generic instead of saying, you must use moss green. You know? Right. So that way you can choose any green that you have, but that's the green you have to use. You can't use 10 shades of green. Oh. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. Uh, hopefully that makes sense. One bottle for color. So any shade of pink or any shade of green. And you'll, you'll read all the rules there on how to submit and all that stuff. Uh, so for the color palette, you have to take a picture with your three models that you used. I'm seeing a lot of people with with piles of shame. Yeah, it's it's a big meme. It's a big joke. It's uh, it's every week. Uh, yeah, lime green, cranky dog. Yeah, that works. And you can mix these, right? Yes, correct. One hundred percent. It's just like any other limited palette challenge. Um, and like I said, this is meant to be fun. So the rules aren't like like if you submit something and you spend a lot of time working on it, and it it's like 
right there on the rule the rules air quotes then it, you'll get points for it. it the whole point is for you to to hobby and do stuff yeah we're not going to be like bring, you're not getting points for that we, you didn't bring, uh, <laughs> bring the community together you know have some fun yeah it's like let's for instance um let's see like i don't know monster like if you got a um, a Frankenstein looking guy mm. and you painted him and we're not going to be like, no, that's not a monster. That's a human. That's a player character. Mm. Uh, you know, we're not going to be that hard on it. This is just meant to be for fun. Um, Sarducci. Um, you can prime it uh, white, black, or gray. And that's it. Uh, that's the only black and white you can use. Uh, the other three colors are the only colors you can use. So you can prime it. I should put that in there. Um, I'm going to put that in there, Sarducci. So that will, that will get changed. That will get added to the limited palette. You can prime it white, black, or gray. And then you can only use the, your three shades of whatever color they are for that month. <laughs> Hopefully that makes sense. Um, is it yeah. priming okay? Yeah, Maldrakar, that's fine. Maldrak, um, that's Scobo, totally fine. Scobo paints, I like that. There you uh, buy a surfer scale and, <laughs> and paint it and then return it to us and we get 100% pure profit. There you I go. like that. He knows, he, he knows how to hit those <laughs> key words. <laughs> um, Sarducci, like I said, it doesn't have to be like amazing contest winning as long as you're, you attempt the challenge. I think the challenge uh, with limited palette is to you know, understand how to mix the colors and mm -hmm. things like that. And it's just meant to be, you know, Fun. You going to uh, give yes, us Francis. a hot link? It's not that. It's not that big of a deal. Are you going to give a hot link? Achilles wants to know. Uh, if you type in here, I'll type it in chat for you. All right, you, Justin, you can you can get off of this. There you go. Here, I'll type it in chat. I'm the only one typing it. Nobody else type it. There you go. <laughs> There's the link. Ooh, I want to type it. <laughs> uh, it's the Reaper Challenge League. Is what it's called, and it and it's and it spans the whole year, so from January to December. And yes, Scobo paints. I will put it on the Facebook stuff, and mm -hmm. I just haven't done it yet because I wanted to get the community feedback on all the rules, like what we were talking about with the limited palette and stuff. Right. I want to make sure I have it kind of ironed out before I push it out everywhere. So. Also, I realized we didn't talk about this in the beginning, and it's kind of late now because we're mm -hmm. about to. Uh, we're matching gifted subs. Yes, we're about to segue into marbles. Yeah. But don't forget, everyone, we're matching gifted subs. Minimum of 25. Feel Good but, Friday. But obviously, uh, yes, Feel Good Friday. So if you could, uh, you know, go ahead and give your... It's Christmas time. Go ahead and, <laughs> and give that favorite <laughs> Twitch buddy who watches the show with you a, a sub. They'll, they'll, they'll appreciate it. <laughs> right, John? Uh, yes. Um, and it went dead. Yeah. Like, holy so, crap. <laughs> Justin. All right, Justin. I'm, I'm getting Lav Mic 2 set up. Yes. And Corporia, then, Justin is feeling better. The drugs have taken effect. Yeah. Oh, Corporia. yes. I, I feel a lot. I feel probably 80% better than I did yesterday. Yeah. More energy, more everything. My sockets don't feel like they're on fire. Uh, it's kind of fantastic. So, Bug Lips is, has a good point. Um, mm -hmm. So all these challenges, a lot of the times you were probably already doing them anyway. So yeah. like you were painting a player character or you were painting a monster, but now it just gives you a way to kind of checklist that each month and quarterly and things like that to get points for it. Sure. But he also said that doing the duos and trios is going to be a lot of fun. I'm excited for that. So the duos and trios is like me and Dave, mm -hmm. we get together and we choose a model. And hey, let's paint this werewolf. So we both get that werewolf and we both paint it. And when we submit it, we had to submit them both at the same time, and then we both get points. Oh. Uh, so yeah. that's duos and trios. And then there's, there's a category for four, four plus. And um, I think it is Reaper-only figures? Yes, for most of them. Yeah. You'll see it in each category. Um, it'll say non-Reaper models are okay. Mm -hmm. Like in the bust category, since we don't make a lot of busts, uh, busts and dioramas, and I can't remember the, some of the other ones. Freebies, uh, those are non-Reaper models um, that you can submit. But most of them are Reaper models because yeah. it is the Reaper Challenge League. Um, and it's our Discord, so I want to promote our models. <laughs> so uh, Reaper only. Uh, so while Justin's getting Marvel set up, I want to... I, I didn't mention this last night, and I feel really bad about it. 
Um, Corporea in chat, one of our artists that teaches at ReaperCon, Aaron Hartwell, is doing a fundraiser this weekend. She's playing D&D &D for charity over on DN, this, na this name is great, Dungeons and Donations. So mm -hmm. DN Donations. I'm gonna put the link in chat um, for their Twitch channel. Here, I'll spam it in chat. So she's gonna be playing from 6 a.m. Eastern time to 2 p.m. Eastern time on the 13th, which is in two days. Mm -hmm. So tomorrow's Sunday, it's on Sunday. Um, so she's going to be playing D&D for charity. So if you want to go over there and give them a follow. Uh, and I believe it's against, uh, what is the charity for? Oh, it's Extra Life and Children's Miracle Network. So shout out to Erin. She wanted me to hmm. um, kind of give a shout out to that. And I totally forgot about it last night. Um, so I want to do that right now. So shout out to Erin Hartwell. And you do some great stuff. So thank you for doing that. All right, Justin. Yeah. All right. So we're getting set up for marbles. Yeah. We have a uh, we have a studio chat. If you guys haven't noticed. <laughs> yeah. A Dungeons real one. and donations. That's such a good name. Yeah, that is. And they've been raising money. I, I went to their website and looked around. Uh, they've been raising money for quite a while. Every year for like the past four or five years already. Uh, and they've earned. They've raised quite a bit of money. So we. I always get down with charities. So shout out to Dungeons and Donations. And I'll put the link in chat at the end of the episode too. Okay, let's see. What else do we have? Take it away, Dave. Yeah, I have to fill here while John gets ready. <laughs> no, we're good. <laughs> I'm totally ready. Do we have the marbles game to choose from, or have you already pre-screened it? Uh, he's out. He's out of his box. Chat. Is anybody playing Cyberpunk in chat? How's it going? I've been watching some stuff with it. I know it's buggy. And I kind of expected that, but Cyberpunk? What Cyber, game is it? Cyberpunk 2077 is a game that just came out two who, days ago. Who puts it out? Uh, CD Project Red oh. is the company who makes it. They're the same people who make uh, The Witcher, all the Witcher games. Mm -hmm. So, so there are a lot of people saying it's good. Oh, you're trying to get me in focus. Sorry. Marmundo 89. Will Terrain Tuesday be coming back? Not Ooh. in the near future. Uh, Ed's a little busy right now. Unless we find someone else who's going to do it, and that time slot's already kind of been taken, so uh, we'll keep it in the wings, though. Uh, let's see. We do have. We do have. We'll talk more about probably next week. We'll talk more about shows and stuff with you guys. because yeah. I'm kind of excited because we I have, have some, some exciting stuff coming up this next year, mm -hmm. right, Justin? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Justin says yes. Aaron will be. Uh, yeah, next week. Next, yeah. Mm -hmm. And then there's a, a rumored Rhonda Bender show somewhere. Do what? Rhonda. Oh, yeah. Bird with a brush. You're going to have to get the mic closer. Can you hear me? I can hear you now. Ooh, yeah. Uh, yeah, they really like, yeah. Terrain Tuesday was actually more popular than we thought. <laughs> um, yeah, I was about to say you guys can email an email if you want uh, Terrain Tuesday to come back, but don't do that. <laughs> I, I don't like it when we do that. Yeah. I mean, I don't think anything has come from it. When we say, if you want to know this, email this. Uh, let's see. Reaper land with John and... Uh, Other Dave? Oh, okay. Oh, John and, and not... Yeah, because you, you blocked the B, so it's the Other Dave. <laughs> the Other Dave. <laughs> oh, John and Other Dave. <laughs> okay. How's this? All right. We're, all, we're going off camera anyway. As soon as John is set up. Oh, I'm ready. Okay. It's all Justin on this. There you go. I'm like super zoomed in. I'm like Big John. Little John from Robin Hood. Here we go. Here, I welcome know. to week two. I mean, wasn't that a great fade? <laughs> Justin is so professional. Yeah, you guys like my beard, Mike? Oh, yeah. The Christmas ornaments. That came from my actual Christmas tree at my house. Uh... Sarah works nights, and so she, when she gets in in the morning, I'm getting up to come to work. And I, when she was laying down to go to bed, I was like, hey, Sarah, um, I'm going to be taking some of the, the ornaments from the tree. Is that okay? <laughs> she was like, yeah, go ahead. <laughs> she, she knows my, uh, my antics. All right. She didn't even question it. 
But it's really funny because those suspenders that I was wearing, yeah. she bought those for me. Oh, yeah? <laughs> because she knew that I would have a blast wearing them. They were very noticeable. Yeah. Here, let's try this. There you go. Oh, How's like that the, sound? Yeah. That sound okay? Po point it. Yeah. That sound yeah. okay? That's very much a NASA, 1960s NASA. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I feel very... Doesn't sound as good as it could, but it'll work. It'll work. Wait, it's way too quiet. Here. Oh, apparently it's too quiet. How yeah, about I just hold it like a microphone? No, no. I, I, you know what, John? I like this. You have to be able to point. Hold on, John. That's true. You I have two hands. No. Guys? You do? <laughs> <Whoa>. <laughs> Who gave John two hands? No. <laughs> Here we go. What time is it? We got 348. We can get going, Justin. We don't need another microphone. This is what I've been doing. I know, what? bug lips. Who knew? Right. Two hands. <laughs> Double rainbow all the way. Yeah, let's see here. Can we get a Bob Barker mic? Ooh, that'd be kind of cool. Bob Barker mic, huh? Yeah. Well, I, was, that, I actually went behind me to grab that one, but we don't have time. So. Yeah, we, we, we got it. Hey, our sound actually sounds pretty good this week. Chat. How many weeks has it been where we're like, how's the sound? And I think today it sounded pretty okay. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Get a Bob Barker mic. Yeah. Oh, did you and... have to Google it? Yeah. Did you not watch The Price is Right? Not for years. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> All right. Let's see here. Oh, uh, sorry, chat. I'm it was latest screen. here. First of all, let's look at the uh, standings real yeah. fast. Leaderboard. Leaderboard, yeah. There we go. Local. December tourney. Let's December. see. There we go. So here the are the top five. Jabberwocky. The Mighty Jabberwock. Corporea. Work, robot, work. Oh, look at Corporea. Copy Nerdy Number Bear. Six. I may be one. A lot of these people uh, won last night's giveaway. Copy Nerdy Bear. Is Lebrowski in here? Lebrowski. 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 Grave mistake. Thank you, Freestyle. That's fantastic information. We'll use that here on these. Uh, apparently, you can move the camera if you hit tab oh. before the uh, uh, race starts. Oh, thank you so much. Yes. Man, look uh, at us. We're getting better each week, chat. <laughs> Someday, we hope to be semi-professional. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. Someday. All right. All right. Let's see here. All right, chat. Here we go. Uh, uh, do we want to do what do we want to do first? I don't know, Chris. I, I'm feeling pretty lucky here. Do you guys want to do safe or dangerous first? Let's, let's see what people say here. Mm. We can also start a uh, poll real fast. Yeah, you can scroll down. Well, a lot of people should be able to, if they see a number in chat, I think they can put the number in. You see right here where it says votes? Mm. So I think people are able to vote in chat by putting something in chat, but I'm not entirely sure. Hmm. I don't know if they have to type in like number 15 or... Let's try oh, look. a hashtag. Wait, wait. Vote. Somebody uh, voted. Uh, uh, oh, oh. Number 11. Oh, exclamation point vote. Oh. Exclamation point vote, yeah. space, and the number. All right, guys. Well, then there you go. You see the top 16 here. Choose one for us. Uh, and we'll give you guys just a second here to, to vote. So it's exclamation point vote and then the number. Oh, you have to put a space. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, let's see. My this amazing there we abundant go. Yeah, anger, that's kind of, cool. What's number seven? This one has seven votes. Amazing marble shoot. It has a one percent elimination rate, right here. But it has a hundred percent rating. That one seems to be winning. So if we do that one now, then we're gonna have to do a dangerous next, guys. Yeah. Right. Which I'm eyeing the amazing abundant anger since it's ninety four percent and eighty nine percent satisfaction. So <laughs> Well the next the next one with the most votes is a zero a zero. Oh rating. they're saying number six is a broken Valadir says number six is a broken map. Uh oh. Oh oh joy. Yeah, we're not doing that one. Okay, well it looks like this one is probably winning. So let's get the because we do kinda have to yeah, yeah, yeah. take it into overdrive here. Okay, amazing marble. Hey, Ron's shoot. not here yet. We can go yeah. as long as we want. We have to keep going until uh, Ron shows up. Oh boy! That's right. We could be here all night. Yeah, Ron's not here, and I gotta, I gotta go. I got stuff to do. There we go. Oh, sorry. Oh man, what get, do we got here? Get your marble in there, Justin. Oh. Whoops. What is that? What is what? Oh, it's just the lighting effects on the the playing board. It's got a, looks like a mixer. Here we go. This should be good. Okay. 
Got all the names here. What we got in our lineup? We got uh, Celtic Boar here with the... Um, oh, ooh. nice. Yeah, whatever this is. Would you say Celtic or Celtic? Ooh, we got the Eye of Sauron here. Hey, from Mad Man. I like. Nice touch. We got Francis. Oh, I like the tie-dye. What else we got? Ooh, whoa. What is this? We got oh, that's cool. Who's freestyling? Freestyle. Shout out to freestyle. There's like a D20 almost. Yeah. Space. Uh, what else? Ooh, what is this? We got Hoppy Hoppy Hippo with... No, I'm sorry. It's daily. 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 Looking like a Valkyrie here. Hey, the one uh, to beat. Uh, everyone else looks pretty Yeah, normal. I got to get in and design mine. Mm-hmm. It's Casmania here. Oh. Wing to Is that a. Is That's that? Valandar. 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 What is that? I don't know. Oh, oh it's a vampire. Oh, it's a face. vampire. Oh, wow. Wearing a crown. All right. Well, let's go ahead and uh, let's see here. Nope. So one thing with hitting tab is not very good. Uh, yeah, okay. Let's go with a minute, and we have one minute here for everyone to join. Okay. That's a, um, that's a nice touch, Justin. Yeah, we have to do that more often. Zoom in to find the design marbles. Yeah, well, that now is, that we can move the camera, absolutely. Yeah. yeah. That's, yeah. that's spot on. Thanks for who, – who said that in chat? It was Celt- Celtic? Was Celtic. Celtic? 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 Celtic. Nice. If, um, if you're playing basketball, it's the Celts. Uh, Josie asked, uh, how do you design your marble? So you have to download the phone app, which is Marbles on Stream. Just download the phone app, uh, and you'll be able to go through uh, the shop and buy different shapes of marbles. So your marbles can be in shapes of like hunks of meat or a diamond, a, a D20. So you can, you can be in things like that. So. so that's how you design your marble. All right, here we eight, go. Eight seconds, chat. Seven, six. I'm not five. standing up because I'll get in the way because I'm so big. <laughs> <laughs> big, big John. Big John. <laughs> and we're off. And here we go. Through the blue blinky lights. Are these rocks that bust? What is I this? I don't know. I don't think so. No, I think they're just corridors. Just Yeah. yeah. They just interrupt. Anki, off to a good start. Licking to brushes. The, to the old tubes here. Yeah. JS Twitch. Samurai Jack got off to an early start, but then he got stuck. JP McMillan hopefully gets down down the middle. I think the middle route is going to be the fastest route. Looking like Lickin' Brushes and Stefan Ballou. Oh, they got Ooh. caught up coming out. Oh, straight into the... Oh, oh. Wow. Yep. I knew there the middle one was going to be the fastest. Oh. It looks like he might be able to bounce out if you go too fast. Looks like these are the broken blocks. Yep. Oh, no. Broken we're gonna blocks. Get, we're going to get people hung up in there. Come on, Corgi. Jeffrey the... Oh, it's Jeffrey Higgins. Yeah. What up, Higgins? Uh, he also streams. Uh, Jeffrey Higgins does. Oh, does Shout he? out. Jeffrey Higgins. Uh, Mini Grinder Studio, I believe. That could be wrong, actually. Yeah. Actually, I don't know. He hit the uh, accelerator. Probably not the same person. <laughs> Let me know in chat. But yeah, shout out to Higgins. away with it. Because <laughs> he would be on the Mini Grinder web. Mini Grinder. Yeah, wrong Higgins. Sorry, Jeffrey. That happens a lot. Uh-oh. Justin is seven, eight. Justin's going to make a play for it. I'll buy you a drink at ReaperCon if you come to ReaperCon. Jeffrey there you Higgins. go. To make up for it. I'm sorry. Oh, no. I David don't... Higgins. There you go. Sorry. I do a lot better with last names than I do first names. Here we go, Mimpos. It looks like Mimpos. Tersucci. Sarducci. Sarducci. Madman. Man. To a good early start. Anki 2014. Anki looked like he might get caught up here in the stairs. Ooh, Sarducci. Sarducci, Sarducci is first. Congratulations. Yeah, Anki, Anki got stuck on the stairs there. <laughs> Shibi He's Dragon right. and Shugimon. Stefan Baloo coming in fourth place. Oh, and then here comes the rest of the pack all at once. <laughs> Too many names to, to say all at <laughs> once. <laughs> Let's see who's in the back. Freestyle. Cat is a dragon. I'm K Markey. Doso. Oh, yeah, you asked me how to say I'm K. Markey last night. Yeah. There you go. Chewy MP. Mm-hmm. Oh, there's, uh, what is it? I never could pronounce it. I'm Karak? <laughs> I'm K. Markey. I'm K. Markey. Okay. Yes. <laughs> Sarducci. Shout out to Sarducci. All right. You did it. All right, look at that. Here we go. <laughs> never before has this happened to me. Good job, Sarducci, <laughs> for the first to place. You got a whole 30 points. Dragon 39 for points. Nathan right. Bia. Buglips in 11th. Yeah. Hey, Buglips. Oh, you see Reaper Dave? Yeah. 12th. 
Yeah. Well, yeah. as long as I beat Justin. <laughs> All right. So here's our new standings hey. currently. So Sarducci uh, jumped up. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Jump up in the second place right here with 39 points. Hoppy, hoppy hippos. Let's see if there was any big shakeups. Uh, Pendrake looks like he jumped up. And then Shibi Dragon also jumped up. There's Bug Lips at 20. Mm-hmm. I'm K Markey in 19th. Camel Rage. You can scroll down to see everybody else's name. We'll do, we'll do this a little bit more slower after the second race, chat. Yeah. All right, chat. Okay. Now, let's see here. Let's go to latest. I think I'm eyeing this here. Amazing Abundant Anger. Amazing. Where? 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 Abundant. Right here. Anger. Looks like it's so abundant, and it's amazing, and it's angry, and it's just perfect. 15, huh? Are we going to just do that, or are we going to put it up for a vote? Uh, no, we're, we're going. We're going. We're going. We're just going to pull the ripcord. Yeah, we're uh, All right. making an executive decision. All right. Get your play in, Justin. Uh, yes. I'll go ahead Next and hit this. Play. Actually, go- I'll jump in, too. Uh-oh. Hey, wait. You're going to be one calling it. Here comes John with the John and the John. And the- <laughs> you know what? If I, if I place in the top five at the end, I get to choose who gets the credit at the end of the month. I think that should be for all of us, too. That's true. We get to, we get to choose one person from the crowd if we make it to the top five. Let's go look at the marbles. Conflict of interest. <laughs> Ooh, freestyle. Hey, oh, that's good. Speed Dig, racer. Yeah. That. Let's see here. There's me. We got the red one. Yeah, that's we got me. The, oh, there's oh the, that's the Valkyrie. Francis. See Francis Ooh. right here. Well, I like this. Is that a pizza? Oh, yeah. It is. Yeah. By the way, I miss, I miss solid food, guys. <laughs> um, <laughs> sounds amazing. Did you see Francis's? She's Where's, in the back right. Yeah, hers is the, uh, the tie-dye one. Yeah. Sick. All right, here we go. We're Francis, off. you're very tie dye. I see. I see you and being a tie dye person. I have to figure out why people get eliminated so much in this map. We're about to find out, and they're yeah. off. Oh, I like this. Look at the momentum. Oops, sorry. Estrogen, one of my new favorite names. I know every time I read it, I say it. There's Reaper John taking up the rear. Hey, Lebrowski was in first place there for a second. Oh, sorry, Chad. Reaper I'm John, on the wrong side. first place. Oh. I'm standing on the wrong side. Nope, you're still swirling. Yeah, we're in the toilet. We're in the toilet of death right here. Ooh, GVD Mini's coming out strong right at the very wow. beginning. Wow, yeah. But, chat, we all know how that goes. The first person Uh-oh. is always normally not the first person. Oh. DNM 277. GVD got really lucky going through the, the red forest. Uh-oh, oh. Reaper Miniatures. Whoa, cheating. We cheating. looked away for one second. Yeah. And then all of a sudden, Reaper Miniatures was in first place. Sounds, sounds about right. Don't yeah. know how that happened. <laughs> Perfect. Uh, okay, let's see where we're going to place we go. here. We should. I uh, wonder where Reaper all the John, is. number three. Oh, nope. Oh, it's right oh, here. Oh, I see. Because that's wider than the platform. So you. Oh, Ooh. okay. You got to have enough momentum going into it right here. Like, yep. That gap. That's where everybody's falling. Mind the gap. Oh, all the yeah. Fs are down here. Bottom right of your oh, screen. Oh, man. So if you see your name in there, that means that yeah. you're F. You're what? gone. Yeah, Ghana. Oh. Uh-oh. If you hit the speed boost. Then that's it, too. No, not that one. The one to the... Oh, yeah. Both. So oh, you don't oh, want to hit oh, the oh. speed boost. Wow. What Justin. A, what a bunch you of cheated. cheaters. <laughs> this is... Rigged. <laughs> this is amazing. I couldn't, I couldn't have asked for something better. Wow. This is, this is perfect. Can we get rigged. rigged in chat? Can I get a rigged in chat? <laughs> Come on, Shigimon. Uh-oh. Oh. So no. lo- <gasps> Bye, Shigimon. Bye, Shigimon. All right, Umbro. You, Umbro. You, you can't hit this. You can't hit this speed thing or you're done. All right. Oof. It's not done over yet. Hey, just to survive this one is, is something. Boom. There you go. Uh, New track sure. record. Perfect result. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> So That's, rigged. You can't you can't write that stuff. You can't write that. So good. All right. All right so where are we on the standings? Let's go and see here. After that one, I Man, don't think it mattered much. Look at this. No, look, the mighty Jabberwock. He was the second to last to die, mm-hmm. and he's in first place right now. So if he survived, he would have had a lot of points. He would have, I agree. Or they, sorry. I don't know. Yeah. The mighty Jabberwock holding on. Sarducci. Yeah. 
Reaper suddenly propelled to number oh. three. Remember, that's that's a random Shuggy, choice. Shuggy Mom in number 10, Corporea in 12. Corporea, you're crawling up. Yeah. Getting up there in standings. Obi Toby Kenobi on 19. <laughs> Here we go. Let's just start scrolling down. Coffee Nerdery Beer looks like you dropped down a little bit. Bug Lips also dropped down. I mean, as expected, that map was going to yeah. F a lot of people. I'm he. All right. Shout out to you, hey, Jabberwock. I'm at 34. Hey, Mighty Jabberwock, have you painted the Jabberwock Mini? Uh, we have one. It's the Pathfinder line, number one. Hey, IG girl. Uh, how you doing? Celtic boar. On the road to T to Mac. Oh, now we're in the bunch of zeros. All these people are tied. Except oh, for no. in the eliminations. And total races. Solid 50th plus. <laughs> Solid. <laughs> Dr. Bob. Couple cosplay. Shout out to Couple Cosplay. Who's dead last? Do we do we know? Spoons. Oh wow, there's so many people. Huh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, perfect. Hey, listen, guys, you can't read. You can't, you can't, you can't write you can't. this. <laughs> this is a train that John and I are clearly running ourselves. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> wow, you can't. You can't write that any better. <laughs> That's so funny. Perfect. All right, guys. All well, right. Well, Ron is in here and getting ready. So, Ron is in the studio. That's right. He's here. All right. I think we're done. That was pretty good. That is, that is it. Yeah. Look at us, chat. We're getting better. Our sounds better. Uh, our lighting's better. Yeah. Look at us. Thanks for hanging out with us this week. This was really fun. Um, I guess, do you want to continue doing the gifted subs or do you just want to give them away right now? Let's just give them away right now. Okay. Okay. There you go, Nomads. Kind of professional. Kind of professional. <laughs> kind of nifty. Kind of nifty. It's all good. Hey, Reaper, Reaper Harley. Harley. Shout out to Reaper Harley. She worked tonight? Yeah, uh, she worked today. Oh, why aren't you be. sleeping? <laughs> there you go. Congratulations okay. to all the new subs. Dicey guy, shout out to Dicey. I'm assuming it's the same Dicey from the forums. Do you take a lot of headroom? Yeah, they do. Yeah, we, we kind of wanted them in the shot because yeah, it feels for the more sound, podcasty. We were constantly messing with because the echo and everything. So, mm -hmm. and so it should sound a lot better. Um, so, congratulations to all the new subs. Yeah. Um, stay tuned shortly at 4:30 ish. We have the Bones 5 Live update. There's a lot of cool stuff to see today. Ish. Huh? In 25 minutes. Ish. ish. Yeah. <laughs> um, ish, yes. So stay tuned for that. We're not going to be rating anybody. We're just going to go down for a little bit and then come back up and we'll be right back. And also we have Reaper Errant tonight uh, at 6 p.m. Central. So come watch our D&D &D with fellow artists and ran by Nightheart Gaming. Frank from Nightheart Gaming. Frank and Ann. Um, right. So like I said, full day of stuff. So we're about to go down, get everything switched over, and we'll be right back. Thank you guys very much, and we'll see you in just a bit. <laughs> Jazz hands. <laughs> this is a city. Some call it Denton, Texas. We call it Reaper Land. 